cool if you had sound effects. Oh, there we are. Hello, top of the morning, evening, afternoon, and good night to one and all. How is everybody doing this lovely, lovely morning? Uh, yeah, I, I automatically have the bubble guts. I think because there was either too much egg or too much milk inside of the pancake. So if I have to sh go in a, in a very quick manner, it's not because I'm sad or depressed or let down. It's just that I'm about ready to shit my pants. But hopefully we can manage to weather through the storm as I sweat profusely because I definitely have to poop. Uh, today we're going to be going over some uh, YouTube comments because I think that's going to be fun. I just recently got a YouTube comment telling me to check them out. Check out this. This is a new thing people are doing instead of posting URLs. Because if you try to post a URL on my channel, what happens is it won't post it as a comment. It'll put it in the held for review because, well, you're promoting a website. And it's like, that's always been that way. Because people will promote like their Instagram and shit and their other YouTube channels. And I just don't like it. So I just disable your URLs. Well, apparently people are getting by with it now. Putting the URL as their name or their handle on Instagram saying... Got Capasila, Capas, Caposolito on Instagram, right? And then they'll say in the comments, check out the handle above on Instagram. Get ready for this. Now, I deleted this comment already, but <laughs> for your ecstasy, LSD, cocaine, marijuana, and heroin deals. Okay, let me, let me explain something to you. First off, if someone is going to go through a YouTube vape video, looking for acid and ecstasy, you're doing it wrong, right? Like, I, I'm not going to, I don't want to promote how to look up drugs, but I I don't think looking at someone's YouTube comments is the way that you will be successful, right? You'll end up on a list and, and people will check you out, but it's not going to be the people you want it to be. It's going to be like the government, right? Or YouTube. Don't, don't don't do that. That's a bad idea. It it looks bad and it's it makes drug dealers actually look professional. Because they're not out here putting posters on a telephone pole. Check me out on 43rd and Apple Street for your local cocaine deals. Right? Don't and if that's what this world is coming to where people are leaving comments on vape videos for drugs, I can't tell you how many ridiculous comments I get that are not vape related. A lot of times I'll leave a timestamp and I'll say, well, check out pokerstars.net for this exact outfit. First off, that's a playing card website that's not close. And stop timestamping shit because that has nothing to do with what you're trying to promote. 